Hello, everybody, and welcome to a video on Kathy Baratown. Or it's just Minecraft with KJ Kitty, who's standing right next to me. Hi. And she has gold armor, and I have diamond and iron, but that's perfectly fine. It doesn't matter what type type of uh, armor you have. The only thing that the only rule in Capybara Town is that you're a capybara. It's pretty obvious by the name of the town. But there are a few little wait, wait, wait. changes we made. Okay. Whoa! Wait. I wanna we wanna wait. Come back, my here. Come back here. Come back here. Come back here. Oh, okay, sure. Wait, where are you going? Oh, do you want me to fix that? Stand here and stand here and look out into the horizon. Hi. <laughs> also, I'm kind of glad you broke that block because I was meaning to change it to a different color. Oh, a coincidence. I know. Because I thought that you should have had a better view than just like green up there, so I changed it. I was going to change it to like red or orange. So, as you can see, already one change is that we have fenced in Capybara Town, and we are going to be letting free the Capybaras. Not like completely, but opening all the doors up for Capybaras to run around. Really. Except these guys, because they're like tanky. And another thing is that we've extended the love garden and changed you know, the heart. We'll, we'll be the, getting the to what we're, who we're adding later. House. And, oh yeah. Uh, well that's the fine, they don't have to. Oh, one just house. came out. Well, it doesn't matter if they, it doesn't matter if they do or not. It's just, it's just a thing that they're allowed to do if they want to. So, who are we shouting out today? Well, I'm gonna get to that in a second, but as you can see, KJ Kitty also tamed a capybara who escaped. And they were legit, legitimately all the way like on this hill. Where you can even barely see the hiding hole. Okay, we're gonna go over here. Oh. <laughs> oh, so we are going to be shouting out. You want to come over here too? If you want to. Juno Songs, because he's a pretty good YouTuber. He he does like song covers, sort of like I do sometimes. But that's only because he does it. Because... Also, um, his most... His second most recent one is also like my new favorite song, so that's another reason. But yeah, big shout out to Juno's songs, and I will leave a link to his channel in the description. I'm also gonna add a porch switch right there. Oh wait, that looks like it, it has fire in its eyes. No. Does he have a channel then? Does he have a channel? Yeah. He okay, posts all of his song covers on YouTube. Yeah. Everyone goes so, um... Basically? Yeah. Yeah, basically. That's what these shoutouts are. Um, so... I was thinking we could make a another house soon. Yeah, a couple more houses, since we've lost a couple of bears in the last couple episodes. Whoa, some bears are free! These two capybaras have left their houses to roam free in the universe. Oh my gosh, all of them have, basically. Okay, not all of them, but most of them. That's kind of... Okay. Oh wait, I'm also gonna grab my dogs. Since all the other capybaras are free, I'm gonna let them come with me too. Come on here. So you can see, you can watch us build this huge capybara house. 
We could build, we could add like a couple, of, we could, if we could maybe add two floor, oh my goodness. If we could maybe add two floors, then we could uh, like. Would you mind helping me get a floor for the Would you mind? I, wait, oh good idea, sponges. Yeah. Yeah. This could be like a downstairs so, cellar. Um, this could be a cellar. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I was so thinking we could maybe do like a hotel way. sort of thing where like you could do it could be like two la three layers because the bottom and then the top could, could be, be like place, three maybe. capybara houses in one. This could, be, this could be like a place for the homeless maybe. Like people can go here if they want to. Yeah, for the homeless and capybaras, like, like since there are only like a couple houses. Since yeah. there are only a few houses and not all the capybaras will be able to get to all of them. Um, we'll be able to have some for capybaras that, like, ones that, that will, we're just gonna, like, spawn. But they're like, they, they, we spawn them but they don't have any houses. They're like, just there. And then, so this will be like, the free capybara house. It doesn't matter who goes in there. Okay, this is the smallest cave ever. Right here. I'm gonna cover that up. Whoa, one of the capybaras is trying to escape. You have the whole area to run free in. You you do not need to escape, Mr. Capybara. Okay, so I'm trying to learn the pattern of how you're doing this. Oh, wait, now I see. Now I can see what you're doing. Also, I have a new tradition of every episode. At the end of every episode, I'll, I'm, I will. Also, people are allowed to get two shoutouts now. It doesn't matter how many shoutouts you get. Like KJ Kitty, you could get another shoutout, but I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. I'm seriously trying to just think of people who need shoutouts. Oh, oh, you can. There's, there's this capybara who's right there. He short. He look. He or she. I don't know. I can't tell capybara or us Um. He or she looks like they want to be in this sort of hotel-y thing, or just like yeah. Like that. And it just ran out. Oh, I see what you're doing. You're you. You're using this now. Okay. Oh, you. Oh, I like this. I like this already. I like what you've done. You've added the ladders to go down. Yeah, every. At the end of every episode, I will give some people a reason to get a shout out, just like random you. To just get a random shout out. Oh, I just noticed that the logs you're using are stripped. Stripped logs, those actually look pretty cool. Yeah. Hey, could there be like an underground path to like, that the like, happy bears can like go under like tunnels like rabbits? Oh, that would be really cool. Like, like you could like. This is like the place. The place. And we could like. Tunneled and just dig up. And we could add like little windows so they can see outside. Yeah. So they can see like beyond Capybara Town. You can maybe work on that. I'm gonna work on the upstairs room. And like, the wall.
how big do you think this should be? Um, it can be as big as you want it. Um, I think this should be. This should be big enough. Um, I mean, we could probably fit a second story. Yeah. And technically, we have three stories since we have like the little underground area that you're working on. Yeah. So. Yeah, I think this should be big enough. This may be a two project, I mean two episode project. I don't know. I haven't actually had a two project episode for a long time. Ever since like, when I was still in the hundreds on my Minecraft videos. And now I'm not. So, um, yeah, this looks like it could be big enough, but a a second story would still be pretty nice, so that... Oh, we would have to be... We would have to use stairs, so the capybaras don't get hurt when they're coming down. Oh yeah, that's what I was gonna do. And then we'll just add a little bit I'm also gonna add glass right there. There is some water down. Oh! Oh, this looks really nice. And you made it really nice in like such a short period of time. Thank you. They're, they're not allowed to get outside right over here. They can just like pop up onto the land outside and like pick out to see what's going on. What's going on, world? How you been? We're cabby bears and we've never seen you before. Or the ones who are still alive. Pretend like I didn't say that. <sighs> For some reason, the cabby bear is up here. My cabby bear and dogs are looking down at you. I think they hear you mining all kinds of stuff and they're wondering what you're doing. <laughs> it's like they're all looking down at you. Oh, hello, Papa Bear, who's running free. Oh, oh, you, need, you guys need to be free. I forgot to open a door, that one. I'm gonna guys. start adding a few of the rooms. Oh wait, I'm coming. Hi! Hi! <laughs> Colored glass was you always one of my kids. <laughs> I know they can look at each other. Um, color glass yeah. being able to like dye glass was always one of my favorite features in in um i nearly said mario in minecraft yeah that was quite cool when they added that but that was like a really long time ago so I'm gonna always in a little, always a little while, come in a, every little while come check on what you're doing in your little area or like this little happy bear area, happy bear area. Well, it's raining. Oh wait, no, there's no, it's just night time. I was like, no. I 
I don't think the room should be too, um, big. Just, like, just have a bed and that's all. That's, that's what I've been doing. Because, and like, the capybaras already have a little while to roam free. And we could just build, like, little slab areas where they could sleep. Like, I just, I, fe I, I recently found a, a little bed right over here. You probably saw that in my coffee shop video. I was like, oh, okay. And you could probably make like a couple of those in the videos. I'm, not the videos, um, the, the, um, what yeah. is it? What, 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 what is it? Oh, in the, um, the town that they could like pop in. Cause like the homeless, they still have, like they have a big place to roam free and they could probably like, Sometimes, there are some times where they might want to sleep outside a little bit to see what, to like, to, like, gaze at the stars or something. I don't know, the capybaras gaze at stars. Minecraft will do. Well, these capybaras do. Okay, I'm going to start building a, a staircase up to the second floor. I added two rooms on the first floor. I hope that will be enough for Captain Bear. I mean, they're pretty small, so... I don't think they expect anything bigger. Actually, no, capybaras aren't actually that small. Ocelot capybaras are. Okay, we might need to make this a little bit bigger. Since I made up made it up to the okay, I might not have to. Like this. I'm gonna come check on see what you've been doing down there in like one second. I just have to really Oh wait. I've been doing this all wrong. Okay, I hear some water going on. Oh my, oh my goodness! There's an X-ray glitch. You, you, you're literally legs when you do that. Wait, it's an X-ray. Yeah. Oh my! Wow, I can see everything. I can see everything up. It looks actually really pretty. Since it's like blue. He got into third person. Yeah, I went into third person. You can only it's see so it. weird. Well, oh my gosh. I can see redstone. Oh wait, so you're kind of doing. Oh wait, you can go into the wall, I guess. And then like, that that's how you see. I think you've discovered two new glitches today. The dancing seeds, and now the x-ray with pools of water and slabs, and third person view, and water, and other stuff that I'm not gonna mention, because I've already forgotten it all. I know it's pretty big down there it looks like up here it looks like we have a little bit more room for a couple more rooms but I don't think we'll have too many more than usual Why did I just make this room only one block? Hold on, let me fix that. I 
think I don't think I can add any other one. It looks like this actually doesn't need to be a two episode project. Oh wait, I just remembered the downstairs which has like a lot of stuff. And it's gonna have like all the holes. This may need to be two episodes, but yeah. Well there are holes! Maybe I could just add glass with it. Yeah. Now that it, this is almost done, other than the fact that the wall. Okay, maybe maybe I can help you. The walls. I don't think we really necessarily have to get these walls down there. Oh, you're almost done with the walls. No, I'm not gonna do the walls down here. I'm gonna leave them natural, basically. Yeah, like what? those. It so, so they, so the capybaras know where they're going. I don't think the roof really matters too much. <laughs> it doesn't x-ray for me okay okay now this is the weirdest thing ever if you put your head you look like a zombie when you do this you go backwards you can then move like this do i look like a zombie look at my hands Hold on, wait, let me try to... Do I look like a zombie? Can you tell me if I look like a zombie? Um, yeah. How did you get in there? Are you stuck? Like, look at my hand. You're not moving. No. Oh, how did you do that? I'm out. So look, I'll show you. So you go under, and then you come out like that, go into third person, and back up, and then like keep backing up into the wall, and then look, now I'm a zombie. Oh, I can't do it. <sighs> I know. Okay, so, um, that is the end of this episode. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, we, I think, I don't think, we might just re work on the, the little bits of the wall, like, while we aren't recording, so we can finish that up quickly. But, the question to get a shout-out, if, I, uh, I already have some shout-outs, but if you want to get a shout-out before the next person who gets a shout-out, then click the link in the description, this, the link to Juno Songs' channel, Go to the video called Battle Marnie with Lyrics and then go down, find a comment that I left and reply to it. And you'll get a shout out. It doesn't matter who it is, it could be you, KJ Kitty. You could get another shout out. You could get another shout <laughs> But yeah. Do that and you might be able to get a shout out. Anyway, I will see you guys all in the next episode oh wait do you want to come do the outro with me so and since we're gonna wave should we just do it on top of the coffee shop <laughs> again yeah hi i can see you flying up <laughs> <laughs>